you must do 300 military style push ups without cheating every single day or you die. You gain $50 for each day survived. How does that change your life? I'm dead. Spread over the entire day, this is pretty easy. First few weeks will be bad as I get used to it. But easy money after that. Until I get really sick. Then I'll probably die man shrugging. I'll die or be in better shape than I'll die younger than I probably would have otherwise. I would probably not have to run or use the elliptical anymore. 300 is an insane amount. I doubt I'd live a single day. I die today. If it's every day without fail. I'm dead as fuck. My muscles would tire out after a few days and I would not be able to get a single one in anymore. Yes I'll die. I don't know if I could make it through the first week. But if I did I would be in better shape and have more money. So win-win. Death becomes me. You never said. At one sitting. So for the first couple of weeks it would be one push up at a time. Then 5 to 10. ECT. Until I could do them all at once. 300 a day doesn't mean 300 consecutively right? I'm awake for about 16 hours. So if I max out at around 50 to start the day that leaves me with 250 for the rest of the day. That's 15.625 push-ups every hour for the remainder of the day. That's doable as long as you keep an eye on the clock. I die. What's considered cheating? Jokes on you. I'm a be doing it on the moon. I can do only 10 to 15 properly. 20 if I push too hard with distorted form. Chest still in good shape. I don't know how. Isn't it that a normal day for the military? After three years, I might be able to take on Godzilla. Be nice knowing ya. I die after day one. I'm anything but fit. I would die immediately, lol. I die. Only one way to find out. I'd be dead from day one. Dead on day one. It doesn't. I'm dead. Died day one. I physically cannot bend my wrist after a childhood injury so. If my math is right, I can defeat any foe with one third if a punch. That's not that many push-ups if you don't have to do them in one set. The $50 a day is the pittance that I'd just spend. Well, it's basically the money I make at my job so I could just quit and do push-ups all day and earn the same amount. And since I don't need to drive to work then even more stays in the pocket. I would probably develop nice chest and arms. Days 1 to 20. My schedule revolves entirely around push-ups with breaks between days 21 to 50. I can do a fair number in a row and I start to have a life again. Days 51. I am jacked and have about $20,000 supplemental income annually. Also, I never need help carrying anything again for the rest of my life. Or, I die on day 2. It makes my day extremely annoying. But $50 per day would be nice to blow. I would spend the next two years traveling non-stop. Funding my trip were push-ups. If you think that's not enough money to do that. You don't know how I travel. Buy military style push-ups. Do you mean burpees? I could probably do it by splitting it into sets and spacing it apart throughout the day. Though it would be really tough and probably counterproductive without rest days for recovery. But I would still probably die when I eventually get sick or injured and can't complete it. $50 a day would mean I wouldn't have to work full time. And the fact that my life would be much shorter would mean I wouldn't need to worry about saving. For retirement. Even though this would probably seemingly improve my quality of life not needing to work full time. I would be constantly fearing that each day would be my last one which would ruin my mental health. Also, 
There isn't much point in this regimen since the reason I exercise to begin with is that I want to have a longer and healthier life. Going too hardcore, especially with no recovery days, is just really pointless. And the sword of Damocles hanging over my head would ruin any chance of longevity. If I were to adjust it, I would add that every week you complete the task you earn a rest day token that you could use. Whatever you wanted. Good to stock M for a rainy day. And an easy day. With a much lower number of push-ups. This would allow recovery and better health and longevity. And will allow you to survive catching the flu. So it just gets easier as time goes on. And you get a workout. Seems kinda like a win-win. I die day one. That's a lot of work for $18,000 annual income. So immediately injuries become a top concern. Because any injury that prevents push-ups is now a death sentence. I think I immediately find the best trainer I can to make sure I'm doing it right and train the rest of my body to avoid injuries. I also pay a doctor and PT to ensure that I can see them any time within an hour. I have to avoid any activities that might cause a serious elbow, wrist, or shoulder injury. Finally I have to assume I'm not going to live until old age before something happens to prevent 300 push-ups one day so I'll have to plan for that. This would be very bad news.